This is the Horse Radio Network. This is episode 1113 of Horse Tip Daily, your almost everyday morsel of helpful hints, useful facts, and practical techniques for horse folks. Greetings, horse people. Coach Jen here, and thanks for tuning in to Horse Tip Daily. Today's tip is from multiple Road to the Horse competitor and author of the Modern Horseman's Countdown to Broke, Sean Patrick, who talks about keeping introverted young horses focused in new situations. And we'll get right to our tip after this from Kentucky Performance Products. The horse that matters to you matters to Kentucky Performance Products. Are you worried about digestive disorders such as colic, diarrhea, and ulcers making your horse sick? Try adding Nalox Advanced to your horse's diet. The ingredients in Nalox Advanced support a healthy stomach, robust microflora populations, and normal gut function so digestive disorders become a thing of the past. Nalox Advanced is recommended for horses of all ages to maintain a healthy gut and reduce the risk of ulcers, diarrhea, and colic. Why take chances with your horse's well-being? Start your horse on Nalox Advance today. Okay, well, I really believe that if, if a horse has predictable patterns, then he can, and if things are rational and fair to him, then he can relax. So what I do at home is I have some default kind of exercises on the ground or on the back or whatever I'm doing, right. and I make sure that he's really, really good at it. And then when I'm in a new place, I go back to those exercises that he performs at home really well, and I also don't give him a lot of straightness. He's a strong horse, um, and so I actually ask for a lot of bending. When I'm in a new environment, I won't just pitch the reins away and let him start thinking on his own too much. I'll kind of help him internalize and look for the answers by doing maybe just a simple serpentine or something at a jog, you know. Well, I stick with pretty simple snaffle bits for the first 12 to 14 months on almost every horse I ride. If I get a little two-year-old reiner that's maybe sensitive, I might ride it in a in a Basel or a, just a halter for the first few weeks or months even just to right. get them forward and relax. But pretty much I'll go with a big O-ring, like a, like a professional choice Bob Avila O-ring or a Jeremiah Watt egg butt. Um, just a simple snapple, not too big, not too small, nothing too fancy. Sweet iron if I can uh, with a nice leather head stall. And then I use a rope ring. I actually make them myself and sell them on my little store. I, I use a, a rope ring set with slobber straps for the first few months, and then I'll split. I'll go to split leather. So, yeah, I just stay with a snaffle, and then from there I can either go to a basel or I can even go to a correction bit. The basel, will help, it helps teach them a little bit of leverage because it lifts the bottom of their jaw a little bit, and some horses that don't like being in that leverage trap can really benefit from a few months in a basel or even a couple of years. Um, also, it can help the rider kind of focus more on their seat and their leg cues. So I actually like my horse to be nearly bridleless before I put a correction bit in. I don't want to ever reach for more pressure or of their mouth to teach something. I want to have it taught and then use that more as a signal bit. So even when I go to a correction bit, I want my horse dead broke on a snaffle and, a, and on my seat. If you don't use your leg, seat, and weight and you rely just on your reins and your hands, then that's all the horse will ever pay attention to. Well, there you have it. You can find links to today's guest as well as lots more tips at horsetipdaily.com. This podcast was made possible through the generous support of Kentucky Performance Products and listeners like you. The Horse Radio Network and the Horse Radio Network hosts are not responsible for statements of guests or their opinions. Use your own judgment when listening to the tips provided by the experts on Horse Tip Daily. (laughs) 